Passengers on board a recent flight from Vancouver to Taipei likely had no idea they were part of history in the making. It was the first time a father and daughter co-pilot a plane for Air Canada, a dream that began decades ago when a little girl sat in the cockpit and watched her father fly. CTV's Shannon Patterson has their story. Pilot Jenny Olofsson is back at YVR after another Trans-Pacific flight. Being based in Vancouver, the Dreamliner mostly goes to Asia, so I do a lot of that. A recent flight to Taipei, the highlight of her career. It was really neat to fly with my dad. Her father, a former military pilot, has flown for Air Canada for 31 years. In the days where we had an open cockpit, I, I took Jenny once or twice with me to work. Did you think what he did was cool? Yes, definitely. And I got to sit in the observer seat, so I got to see everything that was going on in the flight deck, and that's when I really knew I really wanted to do it. After four years of flight school and four more as a bush pilot... My ultimate goal was to get to Air Canada. In 2011, Jenny was hired by Air Canada. She worked at the same airline as her father, but they flew different aircraft until this year, when she was certified to pilot a 787. They asked if they could fly together, and on March 21st, they became Air Canada's first ever father-daughter co-pilots. On a professional level, we got to see each other in our element and what we do for a living. You still have to pinch me today. You know what? Yes, I was proud. I was uh, happy to be there. But looking back on it, I, it's even meaning uh, more to me today. They hope it's not a one-time event. Definitely. We're going to try to do it again maybe every other month or so. And with Jenny's young boys already crazy about airplanes, could the first mother-son flight be on the horizon? Yeah, the sky's the limit. <laughs> Shannon Patterson, CTV News, YVR.